Hi everyone, it's Orkin. Today we have a problem when we are given a root of a n ire tree and we need to post order traverse the tree and return the all nodes values. So what's the post order traversal? In the post order traversal, we are first visiting the root value. We are first visiting a root. Then we are visiting a children from left to right, from left to right, right? From left to right. So let's take this example that we have. So what, which, which, which nodes we are going to visit? First, we are visiting our root, right? So we are taking the value of it. Value is one. So we are visiting this one. Then we are visiting all the children that we have from left to right. So we are visiting then the first one, right? This, this one, this is the leftmost. And we are the, taking the value of the root. Again, for this one, for this node, right? We are visiting the we are visiting the children from left to right. So we are visiting left, right? So left child and taking the value. And so there is no more children. This node does not have any children. So we are visiting the right. So from left to right, right? So we are visiting from left to right. So we are visit taking this value six. And now we are going, so we have visited all the nodes in this, we are we have visited all the nodes in this in this child, right? So now we are visiting the next next child from left to right, right? So we are visiting two, we are visiting two, and two does not have any children, so we are visiting the last one is that we are visiting is four, right? Four, and this is our result. Okay, first thing to do, let's create a result, um, array of integers, where we are going to st store our results, right? So we are creating a new array list, array list, and um, we are going to return the, our list, return the result. And now we can go and uh, pre-order traverse our tree. So let's call it pre-order, order traverse, pre-order traverse. We are passing here our root and we are passing our result here. We are passing our result. Let's create our function. So let's create our function. It's, it's gonna return void and uh, pre-order pre traverse. So we are passing here what? We are passing here our node, right? And also we are passing here our result, which is array of integers. And again, it's a result. So what we do here first? First, let's just check the base cases. If our node is equals to null, right? In that case, we are going to just the backtrack return from here. Now, uh, what is a pre-order traversal? Pre-order traversal is when we are adding first the root value, then we are visiting a left, left subtree and after that right subtree, right? So let's first add to our result right away. We are adding our node value, right? Our node value. And then we are traversing every, every child from left to right, right? So we are checking that if our node, if our node, if our node children, if our node children is not equal to null, right? Is not equal to null. So we are started to traverse. So for right, for our node, it's called child, right? We are going over. We are going over each each child and uh, so node children children so and uh, we are calling our method so we can just uh, copy paste this here and uh, we are calling our method recursively so we are passing child here child and uh, we are passing our result and uh, that should be it let's run it Okay, great. It works as expected. What is the time and space complexity of this solution? The time complexity is we are visiting every node. So it's of n 
and the space complexity is we are adding the value of each node so it's also of n okay that's it hope you like my content if you like it please hit the like button and subscribe my channel see you next time bye